right, so uh, we're back. I've just sanded down the window and now we're ready to prime. Now, as you can see, this window is, it's an older window, it's already been primed. It's already been first coated and finish coat. So we don't need to go through the trouble of priming the whole window again. What we can do right now is spot prime the window and it's really gonna save us time and materials. We don't need to do the, the work that someone's already done. We're just here to do our work. So get it nice. What I've selected here is a uh, two inch brush. Pretty uh, simple and I've got some primer. Um, pretty standard um, uh, primer. It will, uh, what's gonna be nice is we had that area over there with the, um, the nail, this, uh, you know, it could rust. This primer will stop uh, any rust from happening over time. So uh, now we're just going to go back up here to uh, the corner. Remember, we're going to work in, uh, in our quarters so it's a little organized. But uh, we'll start up here and just go over that area and what's important is to remember that i was dusting down with my hand but uh if you want you can dust down with a brush but remove all that dust that we just sanded off and uh what we're gonna do is just go over those problem areas and don't really go over any any other area And that is called spot priming. Your paint is also going to function at, like your mud did. It's going to also be used to hide errors. So if you come along, you know, don't be afraid to fill, fill some of these cracks that you might see in your window with it's a nail with paint because that's gonna you paint is a pretty once it's dry it's a pretty pretty uh, tough durable substance and it's going to be able to last and protect just like your caulking would now luckily these walls are not in the state of being final coated so I don't have to tape everything down. But just make sure that a nice coat goes on. It does, you don't want to be too thick on the coat because it is just primer and it will drip. Now I'm coming down this edge here because these edges were in terrible shape. So I want to just really get a, a nice coat of paint on try to fill any cracks maybe or holes that you might see because the eye will be attracted to any dark dark area on a white paint and I can tell when I'm over here doing this work that this has been done several times on this window and Whoever did it before me, they didn't know all this stuff that you and I are going to know here today. So we're going we're gonna to be ahead of the game, you and me. Go over here, put a nice thick coat over this area where we were having some work done. And make sure that you prime everything that you mudded because if you don't on your first coat it will show through so just be very careful to get everything and again it is a window that's pretty high in the room so we're just gonna have to do the 
underside as well. And it's pretty rough, so you might have to really slob it on if, if your house is a house like one of these where it's got a lot of character. It's been been around for a couple hundred years maybe. So uh, just go back and look and make sure you don't have any drips because getting a drip while it's wet is very easy but once they turn solid will be a very ugly sight on a very otherwise very well prepared window. Let's give it a rub down. Dust it off. Do the same thing though, same process applies. Try to fill in any gouges or holes with a paintbrush. Whoop, I messed up there, but it's all right, because it is a primer coat. It uh, won't affect the finish. All we've got to do is finish up this side. Also, you want to take a look around and what I see here is on this windowsill is a little bit of cracked paint. That's something we're also going to just uh, well, you might, I might have already covered it up, but there were some cracks right there. And that's uh, something, you know, where uh, moisture's gotten underneath the board and it's uh, put, it uh, has come through on the other side and, you know, the paint is flaked off. It should be, once it's dry, ready to finish paint.